Jason, really, really close Scottish Cup tie. What did you make of the match? Yeah, I'm, I'm standing here now and my overriding emotion is I'm proud. I'm, I'm really, really proud to, to represent this, this team and the club. And the, the girls gave absolutely everything. The, the, what we asked them before the game is just to give everything, give themselves the best opportunity to get themselves into the semi-final of the Scottish Cup. And they come off with no regrets. And as I said, I'm just really, really proud of them. Motherwell have been so dominant this season and your side, especially in the second half, looked like the better of, of the two teams. How proud are you of the performance overall that you gave today? Yeah, to be fair, Motherwell, they're a really, really good side and we know how good they are, but I think that's where we deserve a wee bit of credit. Um, the last couple of weeks we've, we've not played as well as we could. Second half, especially second half, you know, I say to them at half time that it's a 45 minute game and it's there if they want it. There's a real opportunity for us if, if we want to get to the semi final of the Scottish Cup. We gave it everything, we, we, we kept going and quite going and going and then even the referee she, she said there's three minutes to go four minutes to go and we were still going and going and going and we never gave up so I, as I say I'm really really proud of the players It was one of those days though where it seemed you could have played for hours and hours and just something wouldn't quite drop for your team today it was just one of those where you just couldn't quite get the golden opportunities Yeah we did create we created a few chances we, we, we did create chances in the second half and it's sometimes obviously the, the wee bit decision making or, or just uh, sometimes I wouldn't say lack of composure I just think the when we're in the areas, we just need to we just need to make sure that we, that we strike the ball or not be too hesitant. And then when the ball drops, we've just got to we've just got to put a foot through it sometimes, and rather than try to pick a pass in, in areas. So that's it. But uh, as I said, we've we've kept going and going and going, and I'm I'm really really proud of the players. Obviously, out of the Scottish Cup now, but you've got the league to, to focus on, and there's still a few games to, to go in that regard. I know you'll probably also have a bit of an eye on, on maybe next season as well, because you've competed so well against yeah. the side that won the league, and we'll stand you in good stead for, for next year as well, possibly. Yeah, we've said to the girls there that that's the standard. Yeah, there's four games to go. We, we want to finish as, as high as we can in the league. Um, so, yeah, there's, there's it's not meaningless games between now and the end of the season. As a club, we, we've got a target where we want to finish, and then we'll look to progress and, and try and obviously get a couple of players from the, the younger team to come up and look to maybe bring one or two in that have got to take us to that next level. It's been a really competitive season overall. Next year could be even more competitive if you know, one of the teams coming down, two of the teams coming up. I mean, it's an exciting league to be a manager and head coach. Isn't it? Yeah, it's great for me. As I say, I remember speaking to you earlier this season. It's great for me as a manager. You get to test yourself every week and all the games are different. It's, as you said, it's really, really competitive. Um, and that, that's one of the things that that makes me obviously hopefully become a better manager, better coach. Um, and I know hopefully it's the same feeling for as well for the players because the games are so tight every week. Uh, they're really competitive. It's, the players are, in the league are good players. Um, so yeah, it's standing, standing well between now and end of the season and then looking ahead to next season, we'll, uh, we'll look to continue to progress.